那当然，我们今天能够成型啊，也要感谢另外一个主办单位哈。我想，在座的每一位都不需要我多介绍他了哈。六年的时间哈，他育成了两百七十多家的公司哈，创造了八点五亿美金的估值哈，非常不可思议的一个成绩。但是这只是他过去的成就哈，他待会会简短的告诉他，他对未来的愿景是什么。未来就从今天这个活动开始，好，我们掌声欢迎林志成 Jamie。Uh, thanks, Tom. Uh, wow, this is unreal. <laughs> Can't believe this is really happening. It is. <laughs> so, uh, my co-host, uh, Professor Gao, uh, and my uh, our honored speakers, ladies and gentlemen, uh, those of you who are crazy enough to join us in this uh, post-typhoon holiday, but I guess there's no nothing better to go. Uh, except here. <laughs> we got a cozy hotel, good food, a good, uh, good line of a speaker, so um, I'm sure you're going to love it. Um, so a lot of people are asking me why I had this idea of throwing this uh, event. Uh, the idea is actually very simple. So um, we at the internet industry have been for a long time feeling um, we're sort of an uh, emerging but alternative industry. So for the longest time, even though uh, the ind industry in Taiwan is developing pretty well, we don't have this event that bring all of our leaders together every week, every year, every week. That's, that would be too often. Uh, so Impact essentially is aiming to become the, the one event that all of the leaders of internet and e-commerce industry have to come to every year. And if we only do that in Taiwan, it'll be a little bit too lonely, right? So we decided, why don't we just open it up? We'll open it up to all of our friends across Southeast Asia and hopefully in the future or around the world. So essentially, uh, we want Impact to be an annual, annual event every year. And we want all of you every year to join us. And we want this to be the event that the, our industry congregate together and uh, we learn from each other. So uh, it's a forum for our industry to come together and learn from each other so that we can be better innovators, we can make bigger impacts, and most importantly, we can stand up against our peers from China and from the US. Uh, if the region can come together, I think we can be stronger. And so, the event is in Taiwan. Uh, what do we have to offer to our uh, Southeast Asia friends? I think a lot, actually. So uh, there are three things I can think of that Taiwan has to offer to our friends from Asian. First and foremost, uh, we sort of developed our industry a little bit uh, earlier than our peers from Asian. So uh, our Industry is on average, a lot of the verticals is on average five to 20 years ahead of uh, uh, things that are happening in uh, Southeast Asia. For example, uh, B2C e-commerce really happened in Taiwan back in uh, 2004, uh, led by PC Home and Momo, uh, both of whom are speaking today. But it really only happened in Southeast Asia uh, two years ago, led by uh, Lala, uh, Lazada and Zalora, I'm sorry, the name is hard to pronounce, both of whom are also speaking today. So uh, I think the lessons that we learned from developing our B2C e-commerce industry over the past 10, 20, 12 years, we have a lot to share with our, our peers from Southeast Asia and a lot of other verticals too. So one thing, we can take what we have learned over the past decade, uh, couple of decades and share it with our friends from Southeast Asia. Secondly, uh, our market is also uh, mar much bigger. Take e-commerce again, for example. Our e-commerce market would be uh, 20 to 30 billion US dollars a year, depending on whose numbers you're reading. So, uh, that's our e-commerce industry. You might not think it's big, it's actually really big. It's 
uh, it'll be ranked number nine in the world. Our e-commerce market is the world's ninth largest. Even though Taiwan is only uh, ranked maybe 25, 25th in terms of total GDP, our e-commerce is actually it's actually a top 10 industry in the world. And uh, it's actually currently still bigger than all of Southeast Asia combined. So by coupling our e-commerce market together with our Southeast Asian friends' e-commerce market, we'll make it an even bigger market. Uh, it's it's going to be a $50 billion uh, dollar market, which will make it number five, number six in the world. So by contributing our market to our Southeast Asian friends, we can actually together bring our market bigger. And lastly, we, we actually have a pretty vibrant uh, IPO market. Uh, as of now, I count 25 uh, I, public companies that are highly internet related. And they're all trading at pretty good multiples. They, have, they all have pretty good liqu liquidity. Uh, at the next, uh, end of next month, it'll be 26 because Co Brothers is going IPO at the end of next month. And uh, Andy is going to speak on behalf of them. So I think that's another thing we can offer to our Southeast Asian uh, friends is our IPO market. We can invite all of Southeast Asia's internet companies to come IPO uh, in Taiwan. And we can provide them with good multiples, good liquidity, and we can make it uh, make, make uh, the uh, p uh, stock market of Taiwan an international one. All right, so that, those are the three things I, th I think we can offer to our Southeast Asian friends. And so besides coming together every year, I think we should invite all of our Southeast Asian internet uh, companies and their founders and, and friends to come over to Taiwan every year at, at Impact. So Impact is going to be here to stay every year. We're going to congregate here. So, uh, but uh, it, of course, it's hard to... Uh, throw an event like this. So uh, yesterday, like Tom said, uh, Maggie decided to visit. So today's event is not going to be the best version we can, uh, we can put together. But uh, we're, in the in we're internet people, right? We're very used to launching beta products, right? So I just want to set your expectations right. Just think of today as the first beta release of Impact. Uh, even though you pay the pretty steep price for it, <laughs> but we, we're going to work hard uh, on, the, on the food side of the equation and make sure we treat you right. <laughs> but te technically, technical issues aside, the, the speaker lined up today, I think, is best of the best for the region. It is probably the best you can find uh, anywhere in the region. So I'm pretty sure, and our host, uh, Tom, is also uh, the best Taiwan has to offer. So I'm pretty sure we're going to have fun and we're going to learn a lot and we're going to meet a lot of people, make a lot of good friends. And after today, I think we're going to be ready to make bigger impact and stay stronger as a community. So with that, uh, thank you for coming and let's kick off the party. Yes. Thank you, Jamie. Uh, Jamie and all of Edwards members, uh, they are very hard to do this event. You can imagine how they are doing it yesterday. Let's give Jamie and all of the Edwards members a shout out. Thank you. Thank you, Jamie. Jamie mentioned his vision for the Impact Forum. You know, in Taiwan, there are some events, for example, like Computex, every year, all of the leaders come from the world. Jamie's vision is to Impact Forum 也成为这样的一个活动哈，所以他该自己说的 ，Impact Forum is here to stay 哈，明年我们还会再办哈，所以待会我们会在门口放一个摊子哈，如果今天就缴钱报名，明年呢我们会给您八折的优惠，啊，如果您用 PC 用 Pay 来付费的话，再打两折。啊 ，Jimmy 提到为什么他对 Impact Forum 有这样的 passion 哈，大家。特别是今天的观众应该都会体会到台湾在网络这方面的实力多么坚强。不讲别的，就讲 e-commerce 来讲哈，我们的渗透率其实是超过很多像中国大陆或是美国这样的国家的哈。但是事实上，我们在国际之间的音量并没有得到合理的对待。那 Jimmy 希望借由办 Impact Forum， 把国际的贵宾带回来，让我们台湾的这些创业者能够被国际看到。好，谢谢 Jimmy 的苦心孤诣。好，我们今天接下来就一起用这整天的活动。来证明 Jamie 的论点